can you explain what Neuralink is and what the goal of it is? Uh, we put a, a chip in your brain to control your mind. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> All right. You'll be able to see Neuralink coming from a very long distance because any device that you implanted in a human is you have to go through a million, so many tests. Um, it, it moves very slowly. You just do a few people at a time and then um, you, you go to extreme lengths to prove safety. Um, you have to go through the FDA approvals. Like we're not trying to sidestep any you know uh, regulatory approvals. We're um, doing everything you know by the book and uh, going uh, far beyond what the requirements are of the FDA from a safety standpoint. Mm-hmm. Um, and the the initial devices will really just be a pretty basic. Um, it'll be about restoring functionality to people who've lost their connection between their their brain and their body. So you can imagine, like if say Stephen Hawking could talk or communicate. Um, as fast as uh, somebody with a fully functioning body. Mm-hmm. That would be amazing. So that's like the what we're trying to do. That, that's our first application is to restore functionality to quadriplegics, tetraplegics, and, and people who have just for whatever reason uh, no longer have a connection between, or have a, a, a limited connection between their, 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 their brain and their body. Mm-hmm. Um, and then the second application would be restoration of eyesight. So if somebody's uh, gone completely blind, maybe even has lost the optic nerve, um, you can actually still uh, directly uh, stimulate the neurons in the visual part of the, the cortex. Um, so you can give, give a direct vision to the brain. Mm-hmm. 